morning fellas welcome back to another video as you guys can tell by the title we are now finally going to palm beach again i haven't been there like four months super excited we got cars and coffee but i don't even want to make this intro long let's get the beat started And I'm super excited to be heading over there. We're gonna meet Noah at the gas station because I gotta fuel up and then we're gonna drive the hour over there. I'm just gonna sit in the car while it warms up and I'll see you guys on the road. Alright, so now we're fueling up and I guess this gas is made out of gold or something because it's so goddamn expensive. Then we got crispy Noah all the way over there cleaning his car, which is probably the slowest car I've ever seen in my life. Like, what the f are you serious right now, bro? Guys, so this guy has perfected the fitment on stock so I'm like that already in the back but I need that fitment in the front so I most definitely have to lower the front just a little bit all right boys so we've got into I think the JDM side right now I think it's an R32 right there oh yo Jesus <laughs> which one I meant Alright boys, so me and Ashley just had a little glizzy break and yo, yes we ate hot dogs, but <clears throat> number one, it's like stupid hot, I mean it is Florida so I did expect it, but I will be honest, I am very surprised how packed it is, like we're like all the way at the end, I don't know if you guys have ever been to Palm Beach, but we're at the left corner and it's still packed. But anyway, we're about to get right back to it, show you guys some more cars and then we're going to head home and probably chill and have a barbecue i think we have to do noah's oil change and yeah should be fun just chilling this is honestly one of the best cars and coffee i've been to it's been like so relaxed right like it's like it's such a nice vibe but anyway let's get right back to it all right so literally hop out the car and i see this brand new gti oh my god with the bentley wheels <laughs> yo look at the fit that's crazy bro this thing hasn't even been out for a whole year and people are already doing this this is so tough holy crap Oh my god, look at the yo <laughs> guys. So let me know what you guys think about this build right here. Maybe sometime in the future to do a truck build because this is a twin turbo 5 0 on beadlocks and with the skinnies in the front. Wow, this E30 is perfect. These are exact wheels that I want on the E34. So these are the style 29s. You just have like the four bolt pattern because it's an E30. But this is so clean, like the paint. Wow. This is perfect. Oh my god, the 992 GT3, guys. I wouldn't say this is my dream spec, but this is my dream car. Oh my god, the black with the yellow roll cage, yellow calibers, manual, of course. Dude, this is literally perfect. I can't even put into words how shocked I am to see this right now. Like, this is an E34 M5. If I, right, it even has the phone, I think it's six speed. Dude. With the purple, oh my god, look at this. Oh my god. Guys, with the individual throttle body, 3.5, like this is, this car is literally perfect. This is my first time seeing one in person. Like this is incredible. This is incredible, guys, with the clears. just hydroplaned and like we all ended up okay but right now we're reversing literally on the highway right now because the Miata just got into an accident when we hydroplaned I guess he lost it but I didn't get it on camera but the hydroplane was actually really bad like we all slid I guess the Miata couldn't keep it together so we're gonna go see if he's okay now this is horrible I hate when this happens but yeah we're just backing up right now it's so sketchy it's horrible All right, y'all, so quick update. We have the fire truck here just for like lane assistance. I don't know if you guys can see that, but they're just like blocking the lanes for us. Um, this sucks so bad. We literally, I'm telling you, we all hydroplaned and it was really bad. Like I had to downshift to slow down, but I mean, this really sucks. I feel bad the fire the fire guys are getting out, seeing if everybody's okay. He hydroplaned and then ran into a pole. It, it sucks. Damn. That's crazy. This sucks. I, 
this happens out of nowhere. This is what happened to me with the BMW and it's just, everything happens so fast and it's just like unavoidable. I know a lot of people say that, you know, you know how to drive, you know how to drive, but trust me when it happens and when you're in it, you'll understand how difficult it is to control a car that's literally out of control. Especially he had no airbags, it's an old Miata, he has no traction control, no ABS, so to be honest, I'd say he's lucky to even be alive. We were going like 75, 80 miles an hour when that happened. Yeah, man, this is crazy.